episodic exotic season round and round filling up the fridge with shit we found in the town you wanna look into my chinese fridge why cause you're nasty i, I wanna show you my chinese, chinese fridge i'm sly i cause i'm nasty too all right we're gonna try it again chong ching punk needs german food i don't know why we don't even particularly like german food but in our last video we failed we did not find what we were looking for this time around Stop by Stop is looking for the schnitzel. <laughs> On this episode of Stop by Stop, we're headed out to John Bay, which is, uh, we're gonna have to make a transfer. Transfer to the three, that's me. <laughs> Noisy. <laughs> Hong Kong subway system is called the octopus. I mean, it's on the ocean, but it's like its tentacles like flail all over the place because it's all going in different directions. Chongqing might actually be a good contender for also calling it an octopus, except for we're not on the ocean. Um, if there's a, a lake octopus, maybe, but as the largest city in the world, uh, these, these lines just, they go in all different directions. Here. Chongqing in the spring is actually pretty cool and rainy, but the humidity is leaking into everything. And it's not actually hot enough to turn on the air conditioners yet. So it's getting pretty hot on the on the subway itself. Everyone's getting a little sweaty. And, and then we're here. Let me ask you a question now. You like China? How come you don't watch our videos? Why aren't you subscribing and liking and telling all your friends? We're trying really hard here. We're trying to, we're out on the, the, it's almost nighttime and we're looking for German food. That's for you, not for us. Well, that was the wrong stop. We gotta go back down. Sorry for teasing you like that, but that was a really great stop to uh, reprimand you for not subscribing and liking. Do it now. This is the right spot. This is where we're supposed to be. And it's only getting hotter and I'm about to spritz, but. You can see the octopus arms, right? You get it now? Okay, now this is better. No, it's not. It's not better. It's alongside the road. Don't believe everything people tell you on the internet. You look like a fool. All right, so that was the wrong side of the road. Now we got to get onto the other side of the highway. Still looking like a fool. All right, so this is the right side, I hope. Because these stairs and escalators are getting goddamn excessive. Okay, so that was not the right exit. We're continuing. Now we're stuck in this underpass underneath a couple of highways, at least two. Uh, but there's this neat, like, roundabout in here. This human roundabout of which I'm getting turned around. I'm not sure which one we're supposed to go to. I'm going to choose this one over here. This tunnel is much more well lit. Meet me at the Lido deck. Turns out we've been here. We know exactly where we are. We didn't know there's a German restaurant somewhere around here. Oh my God, I hope this place is good. I swear we're not buying anything illegal. Look, it's trademarked though. Oh, the bathroom report is not too bad for this weird ghost kitchen type mall situation we're in. After about 20 minutes, Emily believes that this German restaurant does not exist. Or even Germany for that matter. But you know, that's, that's not what pisses me off the most. What really pisses me off is that you, uh, why is it that you only click on the videos that like say like bad things of like, look how bad China is. Like you want me to like make a video about like, oh, how bad China is that I'm always fucking lost because I can't, the, the app or some kind of address isn't updated. How'd you like that? I'm not going to do it. I'm going to continue to make well-crafted, great storytelling videos for you because I'm, oh, oh God, I'm feeling weak from the lack of sausages. Any wieners? We saw this place from the ground floor. We thought this looked inviting with all the lights. It turns out it's shuttered and there's nothing in there. I don't know. It could have been fun. As it seems, most of this mall is, I guess, basically closed, some kind of ghost mall, but I mean, it's very slippery back there. If I fall, like no one will ever find me again. So let's go back to the street and see what we can find to eat. There's actually like a lot of places that are still open here, but a lot of them are like these ghost kitchens. And I mean, I can tell by like, there's like the spirits of like a thousand delivery men walking around. So 
delivery people everywhere. Okay. Ready? Yep. I think this is what's gonna happen. I need you to understand that finding the German restaurant is not what's important here. It's just a plot device for us to, to like create a, a narrative in which we can come up with an exciting adventure for you as you see us go throughout our life. We graduated up to the big table with all the adults when it started to rain. Lucky us. Oh, my mouth is burning. Uh, you know, my roommate used to end all his discussions with bottom line. In memory of Simon, he's not dead, he's alive and well, but bottom line is we're gonna end up here no matter what we're looking for. If we're looking for foreign foods, it's just to make a video. Sometimes we find something we really like and enjoy, but we know we're always gonna enjoy. Look at this. Oh, it's a mess now because we, we devoured, we attacked everything. Look back up at me. Look back at me. Keep your eyes focused on me because bottom line is we're gonna make these videos no matter what. We love making them, but I think it's about time that you start to respect us and give us the subscribes and the likes and all the things and don't don't you dare turn that away from me i got more to say oh we day in and day out we're making videos about being here other people just kind of wander up and i've been here for two weeks and i can eat with chopsticks yada 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 come back and look at me